Welcome back everyone. This is a, a new module, new day, new module. And today we're going to talk a little bit about the different models of disability and how disability is viewed uh, under these two different models. Over the years there has been a number of different models, but we're just going to focus mainly on two of them. The we've, There was one that came out originally known as the medical model of disability. And then we've actually bundled this one and calling it a historical model. And then we'll go into talking about the current or social model of disability. But just before we do, um, I'd like to really just give you a little bit of an update on uh, some of the issues relating to uh, some key facts around disability in New Zealand. Over the years in the, in the uh, census, we've um, had uh, some surveys done and um, the last one was probably a little bit inaccurate. However, around about one in four, one in five people identify as having some form of disability in New Zealand. So that means that uh, it's quite a large proportion of our population. Something that really is noted, I've noticed in myself from a personal point of view is that as we age, disability increases. So what, what do I mean by that? Well, what I mean is that if you were born with a disability, a uh, congenital, congenital disability, the chances are, depending on the disability, but the chances are fairly high that as you age, that disability will get worse. It's a natural aging process. Additionally, you will probably, the chances are, you'll probably get other disabilities along the way, as we all do. It's things like heart issues, blood pressure, um, arthritis, all those sorts of things that seem to come along as we age. So, um, and the chances are if you weren't born with a disability, however, you got a disability later in life, same thing's going to happen. Disability is going to increase, the impact is going to increase, and you'll probably get some new ones along the way. The majority of people have more than one disability. And these, these are some summary points that came out of the um, census over the last few years. Most people have got more than one disability. Physical disabilities are the most common type of disability. Three quarters of disabled people reported having some form of physical impairment that stops them from doing day-to-day -day activities. Um, let's see what else. Increase in moderate disability. So over the years we've noticed that um, moderate disabilities, the number of people with moderate are increasing. The number of people with mild disability is decreasing. So we're talking in Maori population, around about one in five people identify as having from some form of disability. And in Pacific Islanders, um, it is one in seven. So one in seven Pacific Islanders living in New Zealand identify as having a disability. So those stats are pretty um, exclusive over the last maybe four years that the survey has been carried out. 